Hello everyone, Darkvise88 here, giving you another DVD update. Well, the first DVD update. And, um, just got some updates and announcements I'm gonna make up real quick. Well, I'll tell you. This thing's been long overdue, actually. I've been, my uh, camera's just been going in and out through the battery life. And, um, just got batteries for it today. So, it's good. Whew! First up on the list, we got a movie I bought a while ago. But it was at my mom's place. She wanted to borrow it to watch it after I watched it. And, gotta show it to you this time. Pineapple Express, the uh, single disc edition starring Seth Rogen and James Franco. This is a real, now the movie's basically like, they're basically, it's stoners trying to do the simplest tasks to avoid getting killed, and they always end up screwing up for some reason. This movie's very fun, it's just hilarious, like, like the interactions between James Franco and Seth Rogen are great, it's fun, you know. But the end jokes are pretty good. Everything just goes wrong, which is also awesome. Um, TV's got, like, extended and alternate scenes, commentary, a gag reel, the making of the movie. You know, typical stuff. But I got this for 10 bucks at a, at my college, because got the, this guy comes down, and he always sells, like, three DVDs for 10 bucks, or gets some new ones for 10 and this was a pretty good deal. But it's it's worth a shot. Like, if you liked, if you liked um, 40-Year-Old Virgin or Superbad or Knocked Up, you gotta mention Super Bad, of course. It's a great movie. Um, check this one out. All right, and the next one I got. Update to the anime collection, and it's a good one. Um, of course, of course, this is a classic. From the same people who brought you Evangelion and the Sunky Beautiful World, I'm talking about Gurren Lagann Part Two, limited edition. Got this at FYE for about um, forty bucks. Oh yeah, that reminds me. The James Bond collection is gone. I actually um, sold it for store credit to get this nice little number, which is um, pretty cool. You know, I'm going to eventually buy, like, the um, box sets whenever I get a Blu-ray player, since they'll look nicer on that. But um, the Gear and Login box set, you know, it's limited, it's limited edition. Just see that down there. I'll show you all the sides. Nice little art of La Sengan, Lord Genome's um, uh, Gear and model. And I'm um, going to open it up for you. It's volume 3 with Nia on the cover. And um, volume 4, which has time skip Simon and Nia with evil Lord Genome, I mean, um, anti spiral Nia on there. Gurren Lagan is one of my favorite series of all time. Like, all time right now. I mean, it's. It's funny, it's moving, it's sad, it's romantic, it's everything you want in a mech series, and it's got Transformer Mecha who have two heads, and um, towards the end they get to throw big bangs at each other, which is pretty sick. Also, the English dub isn't that bad. Uh, Nia Young is played by Hayden Welsh. For Teen Titans fans, she plays Starfire, and she does a great job as the character. But um, they actually got the girl who, I forgot her name, but due to um, some... Family Commitments, Hayden Welsh can reprise her role for the seven-year skips. They got, um, her voice actress did Ren Tom, did Ren and, um, Trigun, I believe, and also, uh, yeah, yeah, I definitely think so. And, you know, the other dub cast is, like, Michelle Ruff as Yoko, um, Yuri Lowenthal's playing Simon, he's okay, Giant Bosch is Roshu, and a lot of other guys. Um, hold on a minute, actually, I got something really cool I want to show you guys, yeah. So, I listen to some music real quick. And I'm back. It came with this, a Gerlog and backpack. Still smells like really used, like heavy plastic. It's actually, it's a decent size. I don't know if I'm going to use it for something or trade it at a swap meet eventually at one point, but um, it's worth um, a look. But Gerlog on, start picking, if you haven't watched it, pick it up. Don't even, you know, don't even rent it, just pick it up. You'll love it. As a quick announcement, I'm planning on doing a um, overview of my comic collection and manga collection at one point. And also, I'm um, going to be taking a few conventions in a bit. Um, April, check my calendar. April the 11th, I'm going to be attending the Spring Anime Kaiju Experience in Boston. April 25th, I'm attending the another anime con, Yomai Dance, up in Londonderry at um, Game Castle. And Memorial Day weekend, I'll be at Anime Boston. So to my friends and anyone else who's watching this, you'll catch me there. And I'll also have, and I also have plans to attend another anime con in November. Just give you guys a heads up. I'll be sure to 
keep you guys updated with more DVD updates and the like. And you have a good one. Later.